Good day, Grade 6 learners. This is Teacher Joy Marie S. Luna. Welcome to our new lesson. Please ready your third quarter module. At the end of this lesson, you are expected to 1. Describe the effects of gravitational force on objects. 2. Determine the effects of gravitational force on objects and be aware on the effects of gravitational force on objects in daily life. Watch the short video and answer the questions that pop up on quizzes about kinds of friction.
What happens every time you jump? Great! It falls you back down to the ground. Without gravity, you would float off into the atmosphere along with all the other matter on Earth. For your activity, dropping things of different weights. Problem. How fast do different objects fall? Materials. Piece of paper and stone. Procedure. Number one, take a piece of paper in one hand and stone in the other. Extend your arms straight out away from your body. Make sure that each object is of the same height from the floor. Number two, drop both of them at the same time. Observe the speed of falling of the objects. Gravity observation. Number one, which is heavier? Number two, which do you think will fall faster and why? Number three, what do you call this force that pulls the objects downward? Conclusion, how does weight of an object affect the speed of its fall? For your individual activity, performance task, choose between drawing or performing directions. Draw two examples of showing gravity on objects and people. Materials, bun paper, coloring material in pen or pencil or ball pen. This is the rubric. Directions, show through a video on how gravity works. This is the rubric. Gravity is what makes you feel your weight. You would weigh less on the moon because it has less gravity. You would be a lot heavier on Jupiter because it has more gravity. English scientist Isaac Newton proposed some ideas about gravity. According to him, gravity is a force or attraction between any two objects or masses. You learn that gravity keeps you from falling off the earth. Newton also stated that gravity exists throughout the universe which include the planets, stars, and other objects in the outer space. Gravity or gravitation is a natural phenomenon by which all things with mass or energy, including planets, stars, galaxies, and even light, are brought towards one another. On Earth, gravity gives weight to physical objects and the moon's gravity causes the ocean tides. Gravity is a force attraction between two objects or masses. Gravity depends on the masses of the object and the distance between the two objects. Mass is the measure of how much matter is in a body or object. Newton is the unit for force in the metric system. Weight is the force that gravity exerts on an object. Astronauts feel the effects of weightlessness when they fall at the same rate as their spacecraft falls. In everyday life, we can observe the gravitational force and its effect on the objects. Everything that goes up on Earth comes down. Gravitational force is the force of attraction between all masses in the universe, especially the attraction of Earth's mass for bodies near its surface. There are factors that affect the movement of the object as they fall such as the air, weight, and distance. Objects falling on Earth pass through air. The movement of falling object is affected by the air. It can slow down the movement of an object. The weight of an object can greatly affect the gravitational force of attraction. The heavier the object, the faster it moves to the ground. Effects of gravitational force The gravitational force acting on an object is affected by distance. The more distance the object from the Earth, the less gravitational force of attraction. 
The closer the object from each other, the greater are the gravitational force. When the distance increases, the gravitational force decreases. Answer the following questions. Without gravity, what would happen if you throw a ball straight up in the air? Number two, what makes it easier to carry an object downstairs than upstairs? What have you learned on the lesson for today? Share it on Messenger. Multiple choice. Infer the effects of gravity on objects and people by choosing the letter of the correct answer. Number one, what causes the falling objects to fall? A. Acceleration B. Gravity C. Speed or D. Wind Number 2. Why do you move faster when running down a hill? A. Gravity pulls you down B. Gravity pulls you up C. Wind pushes you or D. None of this Number 3. Which of the following describes a falling object? A. It has accelerated motion B. It has decelerated motion C. It has possible stop motion or D. It can go up again Number 4. What happens when you go against gravity? A. More force is needed to accelerate D. Less force is needed to accelerate C. No force is needed to accelerate or D. No motion occurs Number 5. When you throw a ball upward, causes the path of the ball to A. Curve upward B. Curve downward C. Stay straight or D. Falls straight downward For your assignment, directions Supply the missing words in the paragraph to make it complete. Choose among the words inside the box below. Write your answers in your activity notebook. That's it for today. See you at our next meeting.